so basically this is the Samsung Galaxy S the the model with the super clear LCD and not a super AMOLED so first things first the build quality this phone is pretty solid I have a, I haven't exactly dropped it yet and I don't think I want to but it does feel like it could uh, I mean survive a good drop or something okay so the phone is pretty fast let me just show you I'm opening the menu right now see sc scrolling between stuff is pretty fast going to the messaging email uh, you can scroll through pretty fast I mean there's no noticeable lag as such but once in a while it does kind of slow down so it gets fine af on its own after a while. I guess that's because you have too many applications open or something. One takes pretty good pictures, I must say. Here are some of them. It's also pretty good at close-up pictures. Look at this one. The camera does, like, work best when it's in a bright little area. Look at these shots which are taken in uh, not so great light. So you can see that the images have started blurring and stuff. The quality on this, on this phone is surprisingly good. If you want to watch a video I took with this phone, uh, watch my unboxing of the Galaxy Ace. I took that with my Galaxy S and uh, don't get confused between the two, the Galaxy Ace is the slightly lower model, it's not as high end as this Galaxy S. Okay then, oh yeah I forgot, music quality, really important to me and really important to I guess a lot of you. Uh, I listen to music encoded in .ogg or Warbis through the Sennheiser headphones and I must say, uh, the music does sound pretty good. So that's it. The tone is kind of warm, and the bass isn't isn't hyped. I mean, it isn't increased. Though I could do that using the equalizer, but I prefer it subdued.